Right guys, welcome back to our Davkul Cultist Axe Only Run. We are just about to dive straight into the Ancestral Remains, which is a goblin fortified ruin in which there's supposedly, well according to the tavern in Madafest, there's a famed weapon somewhere over here in the east. We've hit this one, we've hit this one, we hit this one, and now this is the only one left I can find, so we're going to try it. Seventeen gobos. This is probably it. Seventeen gobos uphill is quite challenging. Ah, oh, they even have wolf riders. Yeah, this is it. Out of all of the goblins fights we've done so far, this has easily been the hardest. Kriegsman, our heavy tank, can go behind the tree. Anghen Phil. Uh, you can accompany him. Point in that, you stupid goblin. Uh. <laughs> Net me so I can't move and then spear wall in case I advance towards you. <laughs> you doing, you idiot? You bloody melon. Oh, yeah, face has a bad knee or. Oh, no, face moved from further away, didn't he? He's not the one with the bad foot, it's someone else. <laughs> Okay, they're charging now. Okay. Go up against my duelist then, that's fine. Ooh. 
Frederick, what's your defense? You're the crap light tank. You got 65 defense. Uh, come down to and shield wall. <laughs> Keep this guy safe. Yeah. Fuck! That sucks! Angen Phil! Don't want to put Damon up there because he'll get punctured. Punctured to shittery, so... If he goes up there, he'll get punctured as well. Step back and wait. You need to leg it somewhere. You need somewhere to be safe. Fuck. I know it's safe for you. By the wall is probably by the safest, actually. Because you've got cover there, that way. Uh, face. Can step to here. Should have got the net off. That was a mistake. How much defense do you have? 59. Oh, uh, yeah, go there. Shield will lock him down. I hope he can't just shoot over the wall into this guy immediately. That would fucking suck. Mattis can go up there now. What the fuck was that? He jumped back and then hopped back in. <laughs> fuck you, you prick. Okay, fair enough, doggy. Heavy tank, get on the wolves. No, doggy! Good work, doggy. Stopping him from firing that big nasty crossbow bolt, crossbow of his. I think we're done with that ammunition.
Yeah, he made the wolf break. That's hilarious. Big scary doggy scaring the wolf away. Oh, no, it's dead now. Not stepping into that triple surround. Not on your life. Quadruple surround, in fact. Oh, you fucker. Maybe I should have, actually. Yeah, I can handle... F no. Yeah, no, yeah, no, I don't know. No, don't do it. It's just suicide. It's stupidly suicidal. Really, guys? Fucking hell. Fuck's sake! Fuck off, fucking terrible RNG. Oh, if he'd punctured and died, I would have been so pissed off. Got them all. There's the faint. Whoa, it's a bow. Oh, man. It's a super sexy fucking war bow. But I can't use it because it's a bow. I have, it has to be an axe. 50 to 70 is really good. 89% effect against armor is really good. An additional 6% chance to hit is lovely. That is a fucking war bow and a half, and I can't use it. That is so annoying. I would love to give a sniper that. Rah! So irritating. Oh man, what's the point? Repair that. How many tools do we have? Not enough. We're missing just four though. It'll go up to more like six, but that should be fine. Uh, you can change that for that. You can come out for him. Thrower gets attack, fatigue initiative. Yeah, you're fine. You're basically fine because you're in the back row, so melee defense doesn't matter. Neither does initiative too much on you. It's just for overwhelm. Um, Bodo two-handed can go in for you. Hugo noob two-handed can go in for you. And face me can come out for you. Take those arrows off. You look ridiculous. Oh, he's got amazing defense, actually. Okay, we need to pick up more tools. Um, I suggest we just go back to Manifest. It's the closest point of contact we have from here. Closest place, place we'll probably be able to get tools from is Manifest. 
Although we probably picked them all up last time we were there. Seven unholds. Seven unholds. Uh, I would probably do that if I was full health. Which I'm not. I'm quite injured. They're not chasing us. It's not worth chasing them. And these are the 11 um, dumbass wolf riders that have been ignoring us while we run around burning their mates to the ground, their homes to the ground. 11 tools. Oh, nice tools. Two, four, six. Uh, Sell all the shit that's going to spoil. So two, four, six, eight, ten, one, two. Two. What are selling prices like? Two, fourteen. That's good enough to get rid of most of this junk. This is just all the trash I found while I was searching for that one weapon which turned out to be a fucking warbow. Which would normally be super cushy and amazing and I'd be really happy with it. But I can't use it because I'm doing an axe only run. So this really pains me to do this. I literally feel physically nauseous. But I'm just going to sell it because I can't do anything else with it. Boom. Gone. And they're selling it for only 5,000. That thing is worth like 50,000 easily. Oh, I don't feel good. I don't feel good at all. Uh, repair this now. Heavy tank got a level, so it gets defense, fatigue, and health. Oh, he's max level, isn't he? So, yeah. Alright, what to do now? Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I guess we have to come and explore up here, don't we? Get rid of all this shroud up here. We know it's all green-skinned gobbos in this territory. There's nothing over here whatsoever. So, it's literally just up here left. Uh, let's go to Grunfeld. I must trade you some witch burnings. Boa boa. Crumbled farmstead north of Grunfeld. Okay, so there's something up here which is um, worth looking at, maybe. Potentially, with our beta squad. Meat sack, you can go in for the light tank. Uh, patrol the road. Well, we could do that. Holschlag, Weidberg, and Grunfeld. Holschlag, Weidberg, and back to Grunfeld. How much would we be getting paid for it? 53 crowns for times 25 is... 1,500... No, 1,250. So that would be about 1,600 crowns. I don't think it's worth coming all the way back to Grunfeld. I think we just go north, find whatever it is that's there, kill it, and then go to Holschlag. Pick up more provisions from Holschlag. Oh, I didn't check provision. I didn't check Grunfeld's. Who are these people? Can't even see them. 
Some marksman and many raiders. No. Has it done it again? Has is did they just come from the camp that we were about about to go to? A boot to go to. They fucking did it all. And it downloaded it down downgraded it again. So now we just got seven raiders. That's so fucking irritating. Uh wait, let's see what they do. Yeah, they're stepping back. Bet he regrets doing that. That's really funny, it bumped him back and he retreated. He full on routed even. Just from being knocked back.
I don't know what is going on with this playthrough, but it's just every camp we find, before we can get to it, it downgrades. And then there's no famed item. There's nothing there. It's really pissing me off. We've gone to the point where everything's like, there's no challenge to it anymore. We're just wrecking everything, and every time I think we get to a point where we're gonna have a challenge, it fucking downgrades as we're en route to it. And I am running out of stuff to do on this map besides the legendary locations. And this, this party isn't built for legendary locations, it just will, will not survive a legendary location. And even if it does, what's the point? Because you can't use any of the famed gear that you get from legendary locations. We'll probably do that. That's quite a big paycheck. Hunt down and kills people. We're not doing that. Thank you. Coming asked to fight Alps. Any tavern rumours? Defend it from raiding parties. Two thousand skull, two thousand crown, two three skull contract is as hard as it gets in Battle Brothers. So this should be as hard as it gets. Damn it. The Raiding Lord. Some marksmen and lots of raiders. Ooh. I've never seen that before. The Raiding Lord. We're gonna... We're definitely gonna put our Alpha Squad forward. You swap with him, you swap with him. Whoops, you swap with him, sorry. Yep. Yeah. Uh, what does this mean? Release deep defense and reduce hit points and max fatigue. You could easily die to a couple of crossbow bolts. I'm not going to use you. Uh, you go in for him. You go in for him. You go in for him. Take that off, please, and give it to him. We're missing one person. 60 attack, 20 defense. It's you, you're the best we got. It's also almost night time, so we're just going to wait until night. And then we'll attack. The Raiding Lord, and it's a forest fight. That's interesting. I've never seen this before. This is something I haven't seen. Uh, just wait. Wait. I should have used the bird. Take this high ground, obviously. I'm going to take in here as well. Heavy tank and Ang Hen Phil can hold the bottom place slash go down. You can come up here and block off this top one and they just can't get to us then. Don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Whoa, there's the reading lord, man. He's got a big two-handed cleaver. Dude, he's just a champion, yo. That's cool, but the problem is he's only got a cleaver, so even if we kill him, we can't use the weapon, brah. 
Man, that's gnarly. Okay, they've closed. Now the rest of them will charge. Uh, yeah, definitely start hurling at him. He'll have really high melee defense and really low range defense, so I want the thrower to get on him. Yeah, I want him to move there so the thrower can step in. You can wait. You can attack. You can wait. You can step to here and wait. You can step to there and shield wall. You can step to up here and finish. <coughs> finish, finish, finish. Step up and throw. Nice throw. Very good, Halston. Just fuck him up. Okay, he's just not moving. He's just like, I'm not going anywhere. Neither are we. We'll let your other comrades come towards us and then kill them. You can go all the way around. Wait. You can wait, you can wait, you can wait, you can wait. You can wait. You can get to there. Uh, you can shield wall. Ah, good move, good move. Getting on the duelist. Interesting. You can step to there. You can attack him. Yeah, he's going to have really high melee defense. 70% chance to hit there isn't bad. From Trigdor. Oh, he's already fucked. There he goes, he's down. Right, release the birdie. Let's have a look at who's where. So, Anghen. Bleh. Angen. Anghenfil. Can take this guy out, no problem. He's going to be fine tanking them for ages. The champion raiders down already. That, didn't, that wasn't hard. Yeah, he's coming for Anghen, Phil. They're going to have an epic duel by themselves out in the forest. Uh, yeah, step there and shield wall.
We were lucky there were no crossbows in this one. Need to get the banner up there to rally him. Oh, you little shit. Rally the tank, stop them taking too much damage for no reason, because we've, we've got another fight to do after this, boys. Stop getting hit now.
Oh, it's sick as well. Look at that damage on it. 135% effective against armor as well. Fuck me, that is a sick cleaver. That is an outstanding fucking cleaver and we can't use it. God, that makes me so angry. The rage. The rage is making me blind. Seventy-nine to one hundred and four. 135% effective against armor. Fuck me, would that have been a good fucking weapon? Attack, resolve, and fatigue. And the light tank gets defense, initiative, and hit points. Yeah, hit points. Doesn't have Colossus. He doesn't have Colossus yet, no wonder. Um needs Colossus. <laughs> now we come back here, come all the way around and go down to here, and this is where the other ones are. Some marksmen, lots of raiders, and a leader. We want to attack them before nightfall ends because of the marksmen. We're not going to have time to finish this fight though, unfortunately. You just need a shield of some kind, any kind. That'll do. And yeah. Um, I don't know what to do. I don't know whether we should do this fight and then just cut it halfway through or just cut the episode here and pick that up next episode. Uh, we've only got about 15 minutes left. I don't think I can do it in 15 minutes. Or 10 minutes left. I don't think I can do it in 10 minutes. I think I'll leave it. I think I'll just cut the episode slightly early. Uh, we're obviously, this isn't a, a threatening fight. It's just going to be a long one. So it's not much of a cliffhanger, to be honest. And then we'll get 2,190 crowns. And then we'll use that money to buy more provisions and tools from Ernstad and Weidberg. And then come up over here and explore this area. But yeah, guys, thanks so much for hanging out. See you in the next episode. If not, I'll see you in some other content I produce. I make content almost every single day. So, sal wait till next time.